Dzień dobry, or I think that's how you say hello in Polish. I think it is. It's like, Dzień, Dzień is day, and then Dobry is good. Dzień dobry. Anyways, today is day two in Krakow, Poland, and today I'm going to try and head to Auschwitz Birkenau. Birkenau, I don't know how to say it. Birkenau? Anyways, today I'm going to the Auschwitz 1 and 2 concentration camps because it's something I've learned about for so long and it's one of those things that I just feel like I need to see once in my life. And while I'm in Europe, I wanted to take the chance to do it. It's gonna be an adventure. I don't wanna say it's gonna be exciting, but it's gonna be cool, it's gonna be enriching, it's gonna be a good experience. This is the building where I'm staying and it's like kind of dilapidated but incredibly charming at the same time. I'm like kind of like hesitant about this because I'm so scared to like get on the wrong bus. But we got this and I've honestly noticed like, okay, at home, I have a horrible sense of direction. I can't, if I'm driving, I will get lost at least once or twice. If I'm going somewhere new, or even sometimes if I'm just driving regular streets and just take wrong turns, I get lost. But being in big cities has forced me to like better my sense of direction. And so I found that like suddenly I can navigate without maps and stuff. It's kind of cool. One Polish word that I've definitely learned is the word for no, for no, which is nie, because I hear people walking around going nie, 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 nie. Or I hear people going around saying tak, 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 which is yeah, 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 yeah. It's so cute. What I mean about the contrast, it's like a new facade, well taken care of. And then something looks like it's straight out of like, not a horror film. It's not that scary. It's just so charming. And then there's like this mansion over here. Hold on one sec. It's completely dilapidated and like condemned. But it's so cool looking. Oh, the sun. No sun, go away. I am so proud of myself. I'm really succeeding. I just bought my ticket for the bus to go to Oshidensheim, I think they say here, Auschwitz. Um, and seriously, this place is so cheap. It cost me 14 zlotys which is like the equivalent of like 250 dollars, euros, something. And then I just went and got this donut called a bonchik, 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 I don't know. Anyways, it cost me like 30 cents. It cost 145 zlotys. And like you have to divide, one zloty is like 0.25 of a euro or a dollar. So basically you divide every price by four and that's the equivalent of dollars. This cost me like 30 cents. I love Poland. So I'm still on the bus to go to Auschwitz. We're in the city of Auschwitz, which I don't know if I realized that it was an actual name of the city. But we're almost to the concentration camps, I think. And I'm excited, but I'm simultaneously terrified. And it's a weird feeling because, I don't know, I like just feel very heavy, but also very, like I'm looking forward to seeing this. This is absolutely insane. My hand is like shaking, I'm trying to not. <sighs> I can't help but think about is the fact like if I would have been in this would I have survived and I can say without a doubt that I would not have because I, pro I probably would have run straight to the fences tried to climb over just so someone would shoot me
Okay, so now we're in Auschwitz too, which is called Birkenau. And this is the actual death camp. This isn't just a labor camp. This is where people came to die. So we are here in this block in one of these barracks. This place is huge. It's like 465 acres or something. But this is... That was some heavy stuff today. I'm back in my room now, it's 2.12 a.m. and I'm editing these vlogs. I took a lot more footage of Auschwitz, both one and two, and so I figured I'd put it in a separate vlog and do like an extended tour slash my experience of Auschwitz. So if you guys are interested, I'll put the link in the description box and then also I'm posting this to Facebook, so I'll just put it in the Facebook link. Anyways, um, yeah, today was a heavy day. It's hard to talk about. It changes you a little bit. So thank you guys for watching. Bisous. À la prochaine fois.